Hello Collective, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for your likes, your comments, your shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate them all. <sighs> Let's tap in. Let's get a message for you guys. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so the messages may or may not resonate with you. Take the messages that resonate with you, your personal situations, and leave the rest, okay? <sighs> Collective, let's see what's going on. What you need to know, what you need to be aware of. Okay. <clears throat> Return to sender, tower moment, something could have backfired on somebody, okay? Okay. They can't delay something. A manifestation for new, a new beginning is on schedule. They can't delay something. Somebody's trying to find a way to run into you before the new moon. Okay. But yeah, maybe because karma is going to hit somebody on the new moon. Hmm. Somebody's under judgment. All right. <clears throat> yeah. Somebody doing too much. They overstepped their boundaries. Now they something is they know something is over. An occultist. They know uh overdoing it or whatever this is, it's over now. They can't do this no more. All right. Yeah, to Earth Angel. Somebody know you're Earth Angel. <clears throat> Somebody was really very much so in their ego. Now a chapter is over with this occultist. This could have been a leader of an organization of some sort, a group or something. Okay. Main female could be in prison or going to jail or is all in their head <clears throat> about this gift. Official person in the community. Okay. What about this chapter being over? Wow. Yeah. <sighs> Had to take a sip on that one, y'all. Um, a mature male. They not getting sudden wealth no more. It's over. It's never coming back. Even if they had a chance for something in the future, it's, they don't have it anymore. Because they was doing so much. This mature male in the family room wanted some sort of lover in a distance to be under judgment. Because something belonged to a main female and they got unexpected income. Now something about someone's chapter is over, a sudden wealth, a mature male, whoever this man is. Could be a leader of some sort of group. So we got Earth Angels might be shocked or surprised to find out how depressed somebody is about luck, your luck and fortune and your good news and how you don't have to wait for something because it's here. You made the right decision or something like that. Now something is in God's hands. Okay, they can't cause a delay for this. Somebody, you might be surprised how depressed somebody is about this. Okay. Okay. 
as is. It is what it is, as is. Damn, like somebody was they taking it to the very like trying to run the clock out. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. Yeah. Somebody was trying to run the clock out. <sighs> like thinking of every, every, like somebody basically like that energy of I'm not going down without a fight. Like somebody fought to the end. Okay. Whoever this is has fought to the absolute end. Minutes, hours of their karma. Wow. They can't change something that has been created. They wouldn't. Be, somebody's been really trying to change something for a while. <sighs> Stalking you, watching you, trolling you. A whole tribe of people. So a tribe been waiting for an answer. Is this did it work? Did something work? Somebody feels like you're heavily even you're heavily protected right now. And they trying to find an angle. But even when they try think they got a way, angels show up. Somebody's giving me the energy of like a, what are them people called? I don't know why I'm hearing Moorish. I just heard Moorish, but that's not what I was wanting. That was not what I was thinking of. <sighs> What, what video game is that with the guy that sit at the top of the building before he jumped down? Like, one of them kind of people. Okay. I, I don't know who that. Maybe that person is Moorish. I don't know. They're more. Back to that. I haven't picked up on this energy in a second. I heard like a one percenter. I don't know what a one percenter is, y'all. I don't, but that's what I'm hearing. They sent a man to you. That's what I just heard. Somebody sent a man to you. <clears throat> Threatened. Somebody feels threatened. Okay. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Evermore addictions added. Hmm. Hardships. What here and now? <sighs> more hardships here and now because something is happening right now compass a snake yeah you wasn't home you wasn't home absent in home <clears throat> somebody has a personality of a leadership and it was a privilege to communicate something to you the purpose is important because of a prophecy So there's some hardships going on. You wasn't home. So you wasn't around. What happened? Ex 
expectations objective as is hospitality survival their objective like I said <clears throat> something is they gotta leave something alone as is survival objective and hospitality because something was once again too hard okay I don't know Wow, 11 11 as I said that. Mm. Let's see what's going on here, y'all. An ex lover was sitting back watching you get hurt and abused. Now they're salty and mad and upset. Oh, man. This person with low vibration. I told you somebody is intimidated by you. They all in their head because they wanted to knock you down a size. Yeah. But they could have got some sort of communication from a partnership. They're pissed off. Because something didn't work. Distorted mask on it. Split personality. <clears throat> Bystander. Hmm. As is. Somebody's intimidated. Somebody that's married. <clears throat> Maybe somebody want to marry an earth angel. They in karma. For what they did was as is. Okay. One card please, for as is. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> Earlier, the cards flew everywhere, so <laughs> I wanted to close the window a little bit. All right. <clears throat> as is, we got purpose. Someone who knows what they are meant to do in life understands their mission and plays no games and heads all the facts. Uh, a distorted feminine could be that was always under the influence. Something could be one-sided now. So somebody feel like something is one-sided with it because it was only a distorted feminine feeling in a certain kind of way. What's purpose? As is purpose. Irresponsible, lacking like accountability, careless about the consequences of their actions. <clears throat> yeah, they feel like a divination spire or somebody divination spying feel like somebody met they match when it comes to you. Because somebody wants control over you. Really bad. Somebody wanted someone to be irresponsible, this person, because whatever they were planning to do, the purpose of a distorted feminine, whatever their plan was, was to make, it was irresponsible. But, and they are trying to lack accountability. Like I said, somebody could be trying to run from karma. Careless about the consequences of their actions. <clears throat> this is we got herb, herbal herbalist herbalist uh, always under the influence somebody could be always under the influence they don't have this somebody could have a split personality or says somebody had a split personality Somebody know what they meant to do, but somebody could have been irresponsible here. Mm. 
Could be a distorted feminine here. That's what's irresponsible with their purpose. So you could have been dealing with this distorted feminine masculine. You could be a masculine. Yeah, the older gentleman. Need one more for this answer. Somebody with a purpose was to keep somebody distorted and irresponsible as well. Off the grid. Yeah, whoever this is. <clears throat> They met, they match. This person that's off the grid met, they match. Mm-hmm. They can't compete with you because you're just as smart as them. Yeah. Now somebody is in regret because they didn't know you were so well-versed. An ex-lover could have been working on something they've been thinking about, projecting negative energy, or they, they realized that somebody was projecting energy on you, saying you were doing something, but it was them, a distorted mask on it. <clears throat> okay, so maybe somebody knows that someone's purpose was to keep you in a distorted feminine energy and they are trying to lack accountability for what they did to you. <sighs> because if you was a distorted feminine, you would be off the grid. But you could have survived something that they did. Somebody wasn't expecting that. That wasn't a part of the plan. Expectations. Ignored. <clears throat> Maybe somebody was ex in expecting you to ignore your self-love. You're taking care of yourself, your routine. So somebody could have thought you stopped taking care of yourself when you was off the grid. They thought that you were in a distorted feminine energy. Maybe because you were, weren't socializing. You weren't, you changed, this is giving that you changed up your schedule energy. Somebody could be finding out that's far from, that's not even the case. Or they did, yeah. They thought somebody was expecting to think that you ignored your self-love, self-care, taking care of yourself, meditating, working out, stuff like that. <sighs> somebody thought you abandoned your purpose. <gasps> what? All right, or somebody did do this, okay? Somebody thought you were ignoring taking care of yourself. That's what they was expecting to hear or see. What's this? Expectations. And we got ignored married. You're you, yeah, somebody being nosy. Wow. Somebody could have paid somebody to try to sabotage you. But Somebody was expecting an effect to, for you to ignore something here. That someone was married as well. So this person could be in a relationship or something like that. I don't know. But you're like irritate this person demons. Because this person is all up in your business asking so many questions. Yeah. And they feel betrayed by a gold digger. Because somebody like no money, no talk. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Somebody could be going through hardships. Yeah, for acting a fool. Someone knows that they were being childish and goofy, but didn't care about in the situation called for maturity. They are stressed now. They care now. The fuck? Because they met, they match. Again, this is giving that person that couldn't read you. They was hoping that you was in a distorted feminine energy. 
and you would ignore the fact like you would revert back into some old energy that would keep you stuck in an old paradigm. <clears throat> Basically. Because they could have did something to keep you like off the grid or or you could have just changed up something and they thought this. Somebody could have been getting money because somebody thought you were in your distorted feminine energy, just getting high, being irresponsible, but pretending to be you ain't like you're in your life purpose. <clears throat> Now somebody is finding out something different. All up in your business and stuff. And this person is stressed now because they about to go through some hardships. Because they tried to do something to you. Yep. Somebody that was acting a fool is stressed because they have a lot of bad habits, toxic ways, can't stay away from harmful substances. This person could be hooked or addicted to something. Yeah, they keep trying to find a reading that says that you have a split, split, you have a split personality. But for real, for real, every time they get it, they keep saying you high vibrational, and they like, no, it ain't, no, it ain't. <laughs> it's one sided. Like somebody like is pissed off because they hoping your vibration was wasn't where it was supposed to be before this transit or something. <laughs> What? Evermore. What's Evermore? Y'all is wild, y'all. So you ready, ready, collective. You are perfectly in alignment. So this could be next. A relationship, a marriage. Your ex-lover is like giving you the, you know, nasty eye right now. They mad to tell. I mean, somebody is very upset that you are in alignment for this. Evermore. Oh, yep. They can't be acting a fool now. Yep. Low vibrational energy in the reverse. They can't drain your energy. This person wanted to drain you for everything that you got. Okay, you could be getting good karma while they getting bad karma. Oh, that is crazy. So, this low vibrational person was an energy drainer. It could have been a couple for some of y'all. But you're perfectly in alignment for something. Their energy is low. Somebody could be feeling weak right now. And he was hoping that they could drain your energy. What they do for entertainment or on a, on their hobby. Their leisure time is drain people for everything that they got. Now they're getting karma. Someone is getting karma for the pain they caused you. Receiving a dose of their own medicine and vice versa. You getting good karma. So you're in alignment for something. It's like all set to go. Ready to go energy y'all. Wow. Lost connection. Spiritually lost connection. Severing ties. This is like an ending of something. Divorce. Broken relationship. Somebody can be breaking up with a slacker. Someone who avoids doing the work. Prioritize doing nothing. <laughs> could be a distorted feminine. Alright. Take shortcuts on everything. So. Hmm. Survival here and now. You they you know the way you have the direction with the compass there. Okay. Okay, Collector. Brother Raccoon need to find a safe place to go. Then you know they're fucked up, right? Kind of energy. 
Wow, you're not going to let fear stop you this time. So somebody could have been trying to do scare tactics to keep you from doing something or keep somebody else from doing something. Cutting somebody off energetically, spiritually, emotionally, whatever. <clears throat> Unexpected change they did not see coming. I'll watch over you. They, like I said, if somebody tried to do something, angels was all around you. That wolf energy, something about dogs. So familiar spirits was around you or something like that. If somebody tried to do something to y'all, <clears throat> you could be seeing a lot of dogs or something like that. Dogs is definitely one of your your totems, okay? Something significant about St. Bernard's or Labrador Retrievers, Alaskan Huskies. You might have one of these dogs. Okay. Um, wow. A Mastiff? A Bull Mastiff? You know, somebody got a Mastiff? That's one of my... I love them dogs. Ugh. I love women. I love Mastiffs. And y'all don't know what they dogs look like. They are huge. But gentle. To their owner. <laughs> Not so much. They're so smart though. Anyway. But those dogs could be significant. <laughs> Alright. Doberman. Somebody might have... Uh, some of y'all might work for uh, animal rescue, all right, as well. So in this regret, regret, excessive grief, replaying the past, negative nostalgia, a little brother or a little sister. Like I said, somebody was trying to hurry up and do something because they didn't want this karma to hit. It's like, oh no, this person prioritized doing nothing. <laughs> Yeah, the gift of sight, the gift of sacred sight, okay? Y'all my motherfucking unicorns. <laughs> wow, yeah, look at the animals, okay? Oh, I didn't post, I'm gonna post it. I took some cute bunny, I took some cute pictures of some bunnies that was eating the grass in my backyard. I'm gonna um, post them soon. <laughs> it was so cute. Anywho. Um, after sadness, happiness, and hope returns, okay, somebody knows that this is about to happen for you, there's about to be a beautiful shift for you guys, for all of us that is on that high frequency, <sighs> let's see. Magical cleaning space. So thank God for that. Count your blessings. Now what goes around comes around. It's the three fates that's about to happen. Count your blessings. <sighs> like this, like I, I, I don't even watch the news, but I court uh, um this transit is crazy. This this the reason why it's so big is lasting, and I've been mentioned this year about 2044. This is what they was talking about. All right. The transit that they was told, I didn't know that it was this in particular transit, but for good reasons. You know, a lot of people didn't know. 
that they was talking about this when I had gave that reading. And I said, somebody is going to be set from now until 2044. All right, because that's how long this eclipse is. Something about this, it stretches until 2044. But the abundance for you is like, you get to be the, like, I don't know how old you are, but that part of your life is going to be so beautiful. So even if you're younger and after 2044, you um, do something different. You'll be set because it's nothing but good luck. That whole, that whole span, bro. For the next 20, you just going to be just chilling. You know, and somebody could have been trying to do something that was going to make you mess up. So you don't get this abundance and they, they could keep getting sudden wealth. But they can't. It's over for them. Somebody can be a Scorpio. In a distorted feminine energy, Scorpio. Somebody that prioritized doing nothing. They lazy. <clears throat> Look what did I just say? Rapid improvement. Something like beautiful is about to happen. And for somebody else, it's going to, wow, 20 years, they got to be brave. Because it's like they didn't plan anything. <clears throat> Excuse me. Aloha healing. Huh. This is well-deserved relaxation, well-deserved peace, well-deserved not saying like after 2044, your life going to be shitty. No. No. I'm just saying that throughout that whole time, you're going to be able to build and accumulate and grow and be happy and da 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 da. And you won't be set. So whatever happens after that is you're going to be all so set. You're going to be so happy, so in tune, so. Uh, uh, satisfied. Okay. But somebody like, damn, man. Everybody that was acting a fool is stressed out because they toxic as hell. <laughs> wow. I'm telling you, some of my dogs... Okay. <sighs> Aloha healing and you have a magical protector. Throughout this healing. Wow. A new world is born and your Akashic library is available to you. Working in peace and harmony. Oh, that is so beautiful. A break. A well-deserved break. Okay. For the divine beings. <laughs> That is so beautiful. I love that. <sighs> Let's see. What did you cut out here? Entitled. Living a privileged life, treating everyone like shit. This is what somebody, a karmic friend, is afraid of. That's so corny. It's weird because this person, if they wasn't karmic, you know, this is how somebody feels about you. Like, you're going to be in this entitled energy and you're going to be treating everybody like crap, a karmic friend. That's a psycho. That's a false spiritualist. 
a male detective that's easily triggered, all right, by their emotions. And they got mean girls and selfish karmic thieves that was working with them. <clears throat> So who you dealing with is an entitled man child, y'all. Because they wanted what you have. It's something you don't know. Secrets. Maybe this man child thought they was being doing something in secret. Okay. Maybe they trying to keep a secret. What else? A karmic lover. An entitled man child was a karmic lover. And they know you are not on the menu. menu. They can't sweet talk you. <clears throat> nah, into being a mistress. This is crazy. Viewed as the enemy in the third party relationship. Thief. An entitled man child is a karmic lover's mistress? That's a thief? Oh, shit. What else is it? And a frenemy was, is a straight up liar. You can't believe nothing that they say. Is a mistress's frenemy. That's a straight up lie with liar. This person is a scrub. Yeah, you're not on the menu with this joker. So, an entitled man child is a karmic lover of a mistress. That's a frenemy. Oh, this is. Let me see. All right. They could have been working together. <clears throat> To do this, to do something to you, take something from you. They were a part of a plan that went left. Entitled. This person feeling entitled about them. Privilege, treating everybody like shit. That's what this person does. An entitled man child. It's a karmic lover that's viewed as a third party in a relationship. They could have been pretending to be buddy buddy with you, but talking about you behind your back. Or you was this person's mistress. Take it as it resonates. Frenemy. Okay, frenemy promised. So this is confirmation. Yes, yeah, somebody is a frenemy. Frenemy. What is promising? To play mind games with you. Now they feel like they're in danger. Maybe to cause some sort of fantasy or some sort of illusion. Play mind games with you. Like there was some sort of injury. And everything would be okay if he was fragile or weak or something. Hmm. Pray me. Promise to cause some sort of illusion. But that was a big risk. Because you survived. Now they want to compromise. Some, mm. So somebody could have only wanted to reconcile with you to disturb, cause some sort of disturbance to your healing as you travel. So they collaborated with someone that was homeless or poor. What? 
to dominate someone and they'll get their desired results. So they could have paid somebody that was homeless to take some sort of action towards you. I know that sounds crazy, but their plan failed as well, too. But maybe, I mean, not really, it probably don't, because people do anything for money. Who the mistress? You live and you learn. Yeah, you learned about being mistresses and, you know, having being a side piece or something like that. Somebody feel guilty now for overindulging on their trying to get their desires to rob you was like at an all time high. Their desire to do something to you was like, whew, okay. Now they stress, worry, having anxiety. All right. Mistress, you live and you learn. Yeah. Because you learned the lesson, so you were able to be mindful, mindfulness, to save yourself. It was too hard. Somebody, something was overwhelming for someone. Something is too hard because you pull back on somebody, maybe. It's too hard to be your ally because their goal is to cause some sort of illness with a ceremony. But they have to isolate you first. Or you have to be feeling lonely or something for something to work. And somebody could have pretended like they was going to pretend like they helped you. That was a part of the plan. To maybe even bribe someone. To gossip about you. So they can still get donations from this married couple. Or people. Somebody that could be married that was doing this, y'all. This is a karmic lover that you said no to. And they planned this behind the scenes, apparently. Karmic lover. Fail, failure. Cast it away. Homeless. This person could need some money. Because now they're feeling binded. To a loss. They lost all of their luck and opportunity and fortune. To gain. Like they lost some money. Everything. Because of this idea. Or because of somebody's vision. Or something like that. Somebody seeing something. They feel like they cause a lot of damage here. Somebody's in sorrow about the contract. Somebody could be homeless now. Because they were so committed to loot for you to lose something as well. Tommy Lover. Donations and married. Yeah, they not getting these donations from this married people no more. Somebody has separated themselves from an online community or they're separating. So somebody is homeless now because they can't get donations from a couple. <clears throat> Or they love her. Man child. Is sorry. And wanting inner peace now. Man child. They feel like that was a bad idea. Because they can't relax. Man child. It's wanting like maybe. Wow. It's separating themselves because they feel cursed. Somebody could be misfortune. A separation caused some sort of curse. Maybe that's why somebody was trying to reconcile so that they can give it to you. Like transfer the energy or something. But you love yourself too much. Something about the way you loving yourself. Hmm. Somebody hates the fact that somebody also is separating themselves collective from something from y'all or this person is really getting lost a lot. They lost some money or lost something. They are cursed. They feel like they're cursed now. 
Because this was a bad idea to separate from you. Because they was entitled. <clears throat> like somebody was in an illusion or something. Entitled. Yeah. They swore this plan was going to work. Entitled. Yep. Wow. And everybody that supported them. As you predict, everybody supported them is quitting. People are withdrawing. They're being rejected. And they're suffering now. They feel like they're in danger. Damn. Oh. I'm sure y'all told somebody to go get on now. Go heal somewhere. But they didn't get the memo, collective. They didn't want to go heal somewhere. They wanted what you had. And they felt like they were smarter than you. And they could just take it. So, Oh, I <laughs> said, so let's see what we got, y'all. Part the deck. King of Wands in reverse and the Six of Cups. This person can feel powerless right now. Something was ineffective in the past or this person from the past. Could be thinking like something didn't work. This King of Wands in reverse. Being the King of Wands in reverse didn't work out too well for them. Let's see. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. Yeah, somebody could be heavily burdened and scared because somebody did lie. They swore they were going to be able to get away with it or something. <clears throat> We have sacrifice, so hangman. This person could be stuck here in an ending because something came to an end of a delay or something. Now it's coming in. We have the temperance. Yep. Balance and harmony being restored. Yep. Somebody could have went within and seen that you took this leap of faith. All right, to be responsible in this transit before this 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 time period, you stay responsible. You stay the course. What is the um, obstacle here? What's the obstacle? Something backfired. This is all major arcana, by the way. Thunder Bay Fire, Hermit, yeah. Somebody knows that. A Hermit knows there's a tower. Somebody could be soul searching, knowing something backfired. Yeah, this Queen of Wands did not have luck. Luck is not on their side. They could be being investigated. They know luck is not on their side because they could have took this action with a lover to control something. Now they're afraid. There's something that's coming to a complete end due to some conflict in their ego when it comes to work or something because they didn't do the work. They didn't put in the work or something didn't work. <clears throat> the outcome of this. What's the outcome of this situation? But this is, wow, it's a big deal. Of course. It's wrapping up a major cycle, okay? The outcome is the three a cup. So we got the moon. Okay. Somebody is not happy about this eclipse. You're going to get victory and success group. Somebody could be talking about this. This is victory and success here. Somebody is not happy. They watching you, spying, trying to gather information. They are not happy. 
They could have rushed, tried to rush and do something. Whoever this King of Wands in the reverse is watching you, like in the reverse. <laughs> uh, maybe they're like this group is turned upside down. The group of people that's like this is turned upside down to see you in this nine of pentacles. And this something about this contract here, ace of pentacles. Somebody could be mad. <clears throat> Jealous of your ace of pentacles, your new beginning. They are unhappy that they are not going to be able to get anything. A queen of pentacles could be left out in the cold. Hmm. Because something is not going to go in their favor. It's like somebody down to the last minute, y'all. I mean, I'm not lying. <laughs> down to the last before 12 o'clock hit the clock energy. Like, somebody was hell bent like, oh, hell no. Okay? Yeah. It's like this person wanted to win at all costs. What's the hangman? That's just what I'm picking up. Somebody wanted to win at all costs. I ain't give a shit what they had to do. Hangman. <laughs> somebody could have told somebody to relax. They can't relax. This karma is going to hit. Yeah. That was a bad decision. Look. They don't have lack of closure. And, they, and also somebody don't have closure here. They didn't achieve something. <sighs> this person failed to learn a lesson. That's why they're hanging in this situation like that. Okay. Eight of Swords. That's why they stuck. They stuck in some sort of energy that's chaotic. They wishing that they could apologize now or was more diplomatic about something. They heartbroken. They feel like there's no way out of something. They can't cause a stalemate to something. Yeah, I told you they stuck. It came out two of pentacles in the reverse. Chaotic. <clears throat> so somebody knows that they stuck now and they made because they made a bad decision here. To continue to cause, try to cause some sort of imbalance, but they can't. It's like backfired on them or something. You free to go. You free to move forward now. What's temperance? <clears throat> temperance, please. What's temperance? Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. King of Pentacles. So you may be balancing something out with a King of Pentacles. You could be about to get into a connection with a King of Pentacles. Yep. Mm hmm. Oh, yep. King and Queen of Pentacles. Taking this leap of faith and love. Wow. Okay. Y'all are an energetic match to King of Pentacles. Who the King of Pentacles? So, balance and harmony being restored, reconciliation, the king of swords. That's the truth. <clears throat> somebody is emotionally vulnerable right now because that's somebody really in their feelings about you. Now that they know the truth or they want to speak some sort of something like this, this King of Pentacles could be an authority figure as well. This person has really high standards. Of course, the King of Pentacles has high standards. And you check all their boxes kind of energy. You the one. And he don't feel sorry about something. He's un about, uh, unapologetic here. About taking this gamble with you. Somebody wanted to cause conflict here. Because something was it, was, it was a lack of teamwork anyway. 
Because the emperor wanted to sabotage somebody by causing an illusion or something like that. So, so the emperor could be like uh, someone they worked with. They could have teamed up or worked with someone. Or things is becoming into balance here because a king of pentacles knows the truth about something. And they're not happy about this. Somebody got that's bad news. Who the king of swords? What was the truth and clarity about something? King of swords. Who the king of swords? A high priest. Uh. So where this is, they could be a spiritualist. Uh huh. And somebody is not happy. Maybe they're all these. The King of Swords, King of Pentacles energy. But balance and harmony being restored now. And they know it because of a secret. Remember, somebody has a secret. A karmic lover could have had a secret. Remember from over here about donating to this married couple. Or a married couple donated to someone. Or was giving somebody money to cause homelessness or something like that for somebody. Like paying somebody to do something. Maybe that's a secret somebody was trying to keep. Somebody's not happy. <clears throat> yeah. Because your wishes are coming true very quickly. Damn. Like it's like something is fast tracking to the Ten of Pentacles when you take this leap of faith with this lover. Somebody is so mad because they wanted to at least hold on to a little bit of the money in the past, but it's a missed opportunity. They know that they're looking at homelessness or five of pentacles. They are in so much regret. They're sad for being immature or something like that. Tower. So something's definitely being made right for you. What's the tower? Yeah. Yeah. This this magic backfired because it wasn't it didn't fit it was an injustice something was unfair this person wanted to avoid accountability when they was being friends with people that was trying to do crazy stuff so Mercury is setting the setting the record straight because it is a retro retrograde child <laughs> and the magician is ruled by Mercury. So everything is backfiring on these people. What's the magician? <clears throat> That's their obstacle. The magician in the reverse. Magician in the reverse. Okay. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. That's why a plan did not work to cause an illusion. It did not work. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. Three lack team where everybody was confused. Everybody's in some, you know, distorted energy or something. They are in some distorted energy. They root chakra all fucked up. Somebody could be trying to uh, ground their root chakra or something like that. <clears throat> what's this root chakra? Oh, what's the three of pentacles in the reverse? What's that root chakra? Okay. Wow. So everything is backfiring on someone when it comes to their heart chakra. Somebody heartbroken, unbreaking somebody's heart. Solar plexus chakra, some in the reverse. Somebody is feeling weak as fuck right now because somebody is being investigated. They looking into something when it comes to a king of wands in the reverse. And when they took some sort of passionate action towards a queen of swords. Or they wanted to to slow them down. And the queen of cups got to get realistic about something that happened in the past. It's like somebody could have been trying to like live off of a lie or something that happened in the past. And... It's not going to cut it right now because it's judgment. They made bad decisions. And they're going, they can't avoid this karma. And they know it. <clears throat> the moon. What's the moon? Hmm. 
Yeah, they got to get realistic. Yeah, they definitely got to get realistic about this. This person made a very risky inv uh, investment in this situation. Knowing somebody was lazy. This person took a big gamble. What's this Knight of Pentacles in the reverse? Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. You can't slow something down. Some energy. What's the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse? Thank you. Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. Well, gosh, dog on it. This was a missed chance, y'all. Bad investment, bad investment. They know this moon energy. They but since they was in the illusion, they gonna make. They know they made a bad investment. This was a horrible decision. They wasted their money, their time, their effort, their energy doing something. Because your wishes is already granted. Ace of Cups. People are who these people may wish they chose love as well. What's the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse? <clears throat> because of whatever happened in the past. I don't know what happened in the past. But it's a missed opportunity. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody knows in the future they're going to be in poverty. That's what their future looking like. That's what somebody knows. And then somebody's confused, like, how did they get here? Why didn't they do this work? Why didn't they put in the work? Maybe to find out more information. Now they regret not taking this leap of faith or regret taking a leap of faith with another lover. Because whatever contract they binded to something, they so they gotta give up now. This is bad news. Yeah. It's like you love your emperor or emperor. You love you love somebody. You you love that emperor, but they wanted to win at all costs, so they ghosted you. Or did something that was just real mean or nasty or something. But now what goes around comes around. They could have did something due to their religious belief systems a week ago or this week. Somebody felt like you, like, even though they're toxic and... They don't want to put in the work. They don't want to be focused. They don't want to, you know, got bad habits, shit like that. <sighs> they didn't want to change. But they were so focused on stopping you so that at least, you know, they can still get something from somebody, you know. A Virgo last weekend. Saturday could be significant. <clears throat> they wanted to talk to you about everything. All blockages are removed. They're not going to be able to GPS track you no more. Heart chakra magic is backfiring on one of these fake friends. <clears throat> A Capricorn is low-key jealous of you. Your child's father failed you and they sorry due to their religious belief systems. They can't stop missing you. What else? Yeah, they tried to invoke fear in a son or a daughter. Somebody knew somebody was still in love with you. A fire sign. Uh, unfinished business of a fire sign. Somebody could be a Muslim man or a woman. Know that you're protected from all evil or old love. <clears throat> what can they do to get you to trust them again? You made the right choice. Uh-oh. Yeah, everybody knew this person was pressed about you. He tried to set you up, but he couldn't. They about to ghost you. Okay, something about DHS, CPS, whatever, child services is in a reverse on the new moon. Something is not going to, is non and void now or something. Yeah, the magic is backfiring times 10 because they couldn't rob you. 
<clears throat> yep. You have a divine bodyguard. I told you, somebody tried to do something. Wow. If somebody tried to do something, your angels stepped in like, nope. This person could be a part of a covenant organization or a secret society that's on the DL. A week ago, they hacked your devices. Okay, this person got a Lexus. This person has a Lexus, a Tesla, a Bentley, a Porsche, Mercedes, a Latin man or a woman. They could have had your devices a week ago. A Pisces, that's not out of light. If you're reading this, it's too late. Yep. They hired a male practitioner to block your path. Unfinished business in love with a water sign. Mind games is backfiring on Sunday. Yep. So something could have backfired on them. They couldn't cross your path. They couldn't block your path, whoever this practitioner is. Yep. <clears throat> yeah, today. That's crazy. Oh, that's wild. Them and your sister, they are low vibrational energy vampires. Of course they are. They need a lawyer now. In the summertime, they gonna need a lawyer. A auntie. See? Because somebody was stalking y'all at the gym. They see you going through a body transformation, getting fit. And everything is backfiring on them and they group. Celebrity with big dick energy. Could be stalking you. We got a niece or a nephew. I'm going to spend this in love with an earth sign. <sighs> we got a white man or a woman here. They drive a truck of some sorts. A Taurus is afraid you're going to reject them. A new love. She was mad he walked away from her, so she wanted revenge. They wasn't honest with you from the beginning. That's why you get to move on. This person could be a postal worker. They lost their job because they stole somebody's identity. They know what you, they know you know what they did to you, H. They know that you know you, you knew the plan or something. Yeah, but that's why it was a suicide mission. They've been caught. They lost everything for coming for you. <clears throat> yeah. They could be like a crooked lawyer or landlord or something like that. Not lawyer, landlord. Somebody could be a crooked lawyer. Somebody's a crooked landlord. Or they was a crooked landlord to a Libra or something like that. Or a Libra is a crooked landlord. Take it as a resonation. Oh. But you walked away from the karmic. <clears throat> These could have been people that was working with them to, you know, do stuff to you. Yeah, they can't believe they messed this up. Somebody can't believe this shit. Wow, someone is about to get arrested because they phone is tapped. Somebody stressed out to the max for what they did to you five years ago, B. They did graveyard magic. Oh, everybody is worried right now. People was doing a lot too well. People could be just sitting there thinking about everything that they did over the past few years. Okay? And it's like, oh shit. Okay. Yeah, that's what they thinking about this weekend. Alright, I don't know if you've seen this, but say this weekend, L. L M. Somebody wanted sex, nothing more. So they did graveyard magic on you. A cancer. That's a Trinidadian, Jamaican, or a Haitian. Soul of Texas magic is backfiring. They knew you was destined for greatness. Love always wins. They wanted to get you fired to put out. But return to sender times 10 Scorpio. They could be stalking you. A police officer. Tried to block your money. There's a lot of people involved here. I'll tell you that. They couldn't block some money or something like that. <laughs> 
they did less spells on you on Wednesday. Jesus. Nobody believing they lies no more. Hey. They know you the true empress. He walking away from a karmic on a full moon. Libra. They in love with you for real, for real. P. They want to know why they can't find somebody like you. They ask their friend, they friend to watch you and they fell in love with you. So that's why they whole selling sex online. The head came about. They scared of you in real life. Um, green pop. Nobody believing they lies no more. I hope this helped.